China's economy collapsed. Amazon closes over 50,000 shops. Chinese merchants locked out of selling on Amazon are weighing their legal options and looking to Beijing for help after the world's largest e-commerce platform shut down more than 50,000 stores from the country over banned practices such as commissioning fake reviews. A group of more than 20 mid-sized and large companies operating in the made in China, sold on Amazon, market explored the possibility of teaming up in a jointly filed lawsuit against the Seattle-based online retailer, but the plan was aborted last week after the sellers failed to reach an agreement about their strategy and demands, said Yang Zongqiang, the lawyer who represented the group for Shenzhen-based Gaxin Legal Service. While Amazon has the right to suspend the store's operations, it has no right to hold their goods and capital which will lead to further damage to the merchants, Yang said. Many of the merchants started to pin their hopes on the Chinese government solving the problem for them, which is quite unreasonable. It is not known whether the affected merchants have directly reached out to the national government, but there has been some acknowledgement of their troubles. Last week, Li Xingqian, director of the Foreign Trade Department at the Ministry of Commerce, said the cross-border e-commerce industry is going through some growing pains as a result of Amazon's decision, but he added that China would help its companies comply with international standards and protect their legitimate rights and interests. Amazon's crackdown on review abuse and other violations has hit some of the biggest Chinese sellers on the platform. While Amazon officially banned incentivized reviews, 2016 and has regularly taken action against such violations, the scale of the recent crackdown is unprecedented. 